Stevie Wonder took Kanye West down a peg after his comments on slavery, branding them foolishness. Stevie Wonder at the BBC aired on BBC Two on Saturday. The program features a collection of archive performances by the American singer-songwriter, musician and record producer, from huge hits like I Just Called to Say I Love You and Happy Birthday to fan favorites He's Mr. Know-It-All and Love's in Need of Love Today. Stevie is one of the most iconic voices of his generation, having sold over 100 million records and placed among the top 60 best-selling music artists. He is also well known for being a universally loved figure, rarely embroiled in disputes with other stars. However, in 2018, Stevie found himself in an unexpected clash with Kanye West. Kanye sparked controversy at the time after he saying slavery is a choice. The rapper told TMZ, when you hear about slavery for 400 years, For 400 years, that sounds like choice. Responding to the comments, Stevie said at a West Hollywood Club interview, there's been a lot of talk about what was said by Kanye. I want people to understand that the truth is the truth and a lie is a lie. We all know that slavery was not a choice. So I just think that people need to understand that if you know your history, if you know the truth, you know that's just foolishness. Stevie also said he also felt sympathy for Kanye. Especially over the rapper losing his mother, who died after having cosmetic surgery procedures in 2007. Stevie added, you know he lost his mother, the horrible thing that happened. I don't know if he had a chance to really mourn about all that. In an interview with The Guardian in 2012, Stevie discussed racism, adding that he has never seen his race or the fact he was born blind as a disadvantage. He said, do you know, it's funny, but I never thought of being blind as a disadvantage. And I never thought of being black as a disadvantage. I am what I am. I love me. And I don't mean that egotistically, I love that God has allowed me to take whatever it was that I had and to make something out of it. On whether racism can be defeated, he added, it can't be obliterated until people confront the demon in the spirit.